Then next we have this. What's this? <laughs> chicken fungi. Ah, chicken fungi. <laughs> Hey guys! Welcome to the fourth and final episode of Great Food Presents Tapa Wadi. And today we are going to try the food from Collins Grill. Yay! First up today we are going to have this. This is the signature grilled chicken chop meal. So as you can see, comes with the ali olio, the chicken chop itself. This is the black pepper sauce, some salads, and the corn. Bang. This is the chicken fungi aglio olio with tempura squid. Apparently, the tempura is invisible. They messed it up and we didn't get the tempura. And next up, the last one, we have this one. This is the truffle mushroom soup. So if you order this, it comes with the soup itself. Shall we dig in? Let's, we shall. Let's okay, go. which one shall we do first? Mm. Shall we start with the soup since it's an appetizer, right? Yeah. Start with the soup. Let's go. 3, 2, 1. Mm. Oh wow. It's not as peppery as I thought. Because mm. you know some of the mushroom soups are very peppery. It's very one smooth soup. though. Yeah, it's really very smooth. Like, there's very no smooth. lumpy stuff in it. Like right, some, some places, their yeah, mushroom soup comes with a bit of like small shards of pepper and mushrooms yeah. itself. Nothing is overpowering or very balanced. Yeah, and we really shall like try this. the missing items. Oh, where's the invisible sotong? Let me try some. Yeah. Mm. I love the sotong. Ooh. Yeah. Is it crispy? Very crispy. I'll try to find some fungus for you. Probably Everybody should loves him. him. Well, He's I, a fun yeah. guy. How do you think of the pasta itself? This is a bit spicier than I thought. The other ugly ogres I've had they are not that spicy and it's like salty enough, oily enough, everything is just right. But I think like the pasta itself is slightly overcooked. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's supposed to be al dente but mm -hmm. it's not. Mm -hmm. Flavor wise, everything's alright. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> slurp it, slurp it, slurp it. <laughs> the last one, the signature chicken chop meat. Do you do think this? the black pepper sauce would be great? I think so. Let me just take a whiff. Look at this. It smells ordinary. Can't smell it. Oh man. My lord. Nope. Uh, Note to everyone sand noodles, not nudes. <laughs> Do you veggies? Not this. Salad ew. Veggie is still very crisp. Mm. Yeah, very crunchy. It tastes like mac chicken without the chicken. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit tougher than I expected. For the chicken? Yeah. I think it's because it's been in the box while, right? for a yeah. while. And the the black pepper sauce itself, it's not as peppery as, as I hope it would be. It's quite sweet. It, it could be more peppery, I hope. Oh well. I like it. Because it's not that peppery, it just tastes like a normal brown sauce. So how would you rate the food? Overall, I think it's about 3.5 grapes out of 5. Oh, nice. So for, for me, I really enjoyed like the food itself. Everything was good. The noodles can be cooked better. I'm used to eating al dente, it's slightly over, but it's fine. The taste was there, everything's good. Yeah. yeah. So for me, I would rate, rate this at least like same as you, 3.5 as well. So how much yeah. was all this actually? All of this cost around $20? Under $20? Wow. Like yeah. for two mains and two soups. Mm -hmm. It's All actually right. really worth it. Maybe it'd be better if they remember to give us the tempura right. squid. We've come to the end of the last episode and we hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. So if you want to know where we get all this amazing food from, just hit the description box down below. Information will be there. And if you want to have more content such like this, give us a comment. Yeah. Peace. Bye, see you. <laughs>